Intermittent fasting is an eating pattern that involves alternating periods of fasting and eating. This method has gained popularity in recent years due to its potential health benefits, including weight loss, improved insulin sensitivity, and reduced inflammation. In this video, we will explore how intermittent fasting affects blood sugar levels and its implications for people with diabetes. What is blood sugar? Blood sugar, also known as blood glucose, is the main source of energy for the body's cells. It comes from the foods we eat and is transported through the bloodstream to the cells where it is used for energy. The hormone insulin, which is produced by the pancreas, helps regulate blood sugar levels by signaling the cells to take up glucose from the bloodstream. How Intermittent Fasting Affects Blood Sugar Intermittent fasting can affect blood sugar levels in several ways. Reduced Insulin Resistance Insulin resistance is a condition in which the body's cells become less responsive to insulin, leading to higher blood sugar levels. Studies have shown that intermittent fasting can improve insulin sensitivity, which means that the body can use insulin more effectively to lower blood sugar levels. Increased fat burning. During the fasting period, the body needs to find alternative sources of energy to fuel itself. One of these sources is stored fat. Intermittent fasting can increase the body's ability to burn fat for energy, which can lead to lower blood sugar levels. Reduced calorie intake. When you fast, you restrict your calorie intake, which can lead to weight loss. This can also help lower blood sugar levels, as excess weight is a risk factor for insulin resistance and type 2 diabetes. Improved hormone balance. Intermittent fasting has been shown to affect the levels of several hormones involved in blood sugar regulation including insulin, glucagon, and growth hormone. These changes can lead to lower blood sugar levels and improved insulin sensitivity. Implications for people with diabetes. For people with diabetes, managing blood sugar levels is essential for preventing long-term complications such as nerve damage, kidney disease, and blindness. While intermittent fasting can have potential benefits for blood sugar control, it is important to approach it with caution and under the guidance of a healthcare provider. People with diabetes who take insulin or certain medications may need to adjust their dosages or timing of medication to prevent hypoglycemia. Low blood sugar. It is also important to monitor blood sugar levels regularly and make adjustments to the fasting pattern or medication regimen as needed. Can intermittent fasting reverse diabetes? Intermittent fasting has been shown to have potential benefits for people with diabetes, including improved blood sugar control and increased insulin sensitivity. However, it is important to note that there is currently no cure for diabetes, and intermittent fasting should not be seen as a substitute for medical treatment or medication. Type 2 diabetes is a condition in which the body becomes less responsive to insulin, leading to higher blood sugar levels. Research has shown that intermittent fasting can improve insulin sensitivity, which means that the body can use insulin more effectively to lower blood sugar levels. This can potentially help manage blood sugar levels in people with type 2 diabetes. There have been several studies that have explored the effects of intermittent fasting on diabetes management. One study published in the journal BMJ Open Diabetes Research and Care found that intermittent fasting can lead to significant improvements in blood sugar control, insulin sensitivity, and blood pressure in people with type 2 diabetes. Another study published in the journal Nutrients found that alternate day fasting, a type of intermittent fasting, improved insulin sensitivity and blood sugar control in overweight adults with type 2 diabetes. While these studies are promising, it is important to note that the effects of intermittent fasting on diabetes management may vary depending on individual factors such as age, weight, and overall health. It is also important to approach intermittent fasting with caution and under the guidance of a healthcare provider, especially for people who take insulin or certain medications for diabetes. In conclusion, while intermittent fasting may have potential benefits for diabetes management, it is important to remember that there is currently no cure for diabetes and that medication and medical treatment are still necessary for managing the condition. Intermittent fasting should be approached with caution and under the guidance of a healthcare provider. Stay safe and stay healthy. Thanks for watching.